I was laughing because like she like she just effed up. <laughs> she looks like she's one of those people who just want to go to a barber shop and not even speak. But then she like then she realized like oh my god I'm at a woke barber shop where I'm actually gonna have to talk to the barber because she's woke and wants to talk about pronouns and BS like that. Honestly, that's her. That's her barber shop. She can do whatever she wants. But oh my god, I don't like going to barber shop simply because I have to speak. So the fact that they are talking about pronouns, and then she's asking when I sat here to pay you to do my hair, you're asking me, can I touch your hair? It's like right off the bat, don't even touch my hair because you're gonna mess it up. Despite how like you know embarrassing and cringy this is, that was her choice to sit in that chair and to sit there and talk about her pronouns and. Being being asked, can she touch her hair? So I'm I'm good with it. I'm I'm good with watching the misery unfold and watching these videos and making me laugh at them because like honestly, you just you just honestly eat your own stuff up. Like it's so embarrassing. You know it's embarrassing. You can just tell on her face how like she effed up by just sitting down in that one chair alone. Oh, all in the name of virtue signaling and pandering. You gotta love it.